I'll be talking about the original designs of each of my characters. I will not draw them, but I will explain to them. Uh, I will explain to y'all about it and also about their personas or so. So first off, we're going to start off with Vino. Vino's original design, he was supposed to be a transgender woman. If you don't know what's a transgender woman, it's a male to a female. He was supposed to be transgender, but the thing is that transgender people have short life spam, so I don't want him to be transgender. It's not because I'm transphobic or anything, but... I don't want him to be transgender because I feel like it's not going to fit well on him. And also, he'll have a short lifespan, so I don't want that to happen to him. Uh, also, I kind of um, watched this one video where like they were like comparing short lifespans or so. It was like, being transgender, you get a, li- a shorter lifespan. So, I'm like, oh, no, I don't want Vino to... I don't want Vino to die. And yes, I did change Vino's um, <laughs> closing. So, anyways, for Vino, he was supposed to be a transgender woman, and he was supposed to have much more shorter hair, and he never wear a mask. And the fact is that he was supposed to have fur goals. And the thing is that Vino was supposed to be Botan's older cousin, or mostly Botan's childhood best friend. Well, I felt like they should not be cousins or childhood best friends, so I decided to make them as siblings instead. Next one is Botan. Yes, I changed his outfit, of course, and he has a cute little fish hat. Anyways, for Botan, Botan's original design, he was supposed to be an attractive, taller guy. He is supposed to be much more, a little bit stronger, but Botan's new form, he's much more stronger. So, he was supposed to have all the ladies' attention, and he was supposed to be very attractive. And yes, he was very fucking muscular. And he had the most sexiest hair. But ever since then, when I was talking about Botan, I feel like Botan is supposed to be like a short guy's name. And a cute guy's name. So, I decided to... Rechange Botan into a much more smaller guy, and he looks like a kid. And also, he used his cute looks to get away with everything. And also, don't let his cuteness fool you because you do not want to know because you do not want to get into his horrible bad side because he is known for having a horrible bad side that people don't want to be near to. And also for Botan, he was supposed to be a he was supposed to be a poisonous lizard, but I don't want that to happen. So instead, I decided to make him again a poisonous lizard, but this time he has mostly his blood is venomous and also <clears throat> and also every time if you ever lick his blood your mouth will burn or your stomach would burn your insides will burn very badly so he, that's why he's a hack he's a half doko because of his blood his blood is the same poison type as the doko blood i mean that's the doko skin so there's botan design next one is going to be piper now for piper she was originated so she was supposed to be a guy her original name was supposed to be pipper but but ever since then her her new design kind of changed up i changed pipper into a thin boy, but I didn't know what's a thin boy, so I decided to change Pepper into a absolute female. So Pepper is now Piper. Anyways, for Pepper and Piper, Pepper, his original, I mean Piper's original design, him, I mean her being a guy, and she was supposed to have like very short hair, like really fucking short hair. And she was supposed to have dark blue hair. And her eye colors were supposed to be mostly half cyan and half pink. So, yeah. And also, she has a twin sister named Pippi. So, yeah. 
mostly for Piper. Piper is now a female, and she is known for mostly being a very, very horny <clears throat> young girl. I mean, that explains why she is friends with Botan. But anyways, I changed her height, so... So, because, um, Doku creatures are, like, very fucking tall, so I decided to change her height into mostly her being up to 10 feet tall. I, um, 10 feet tall. Yeah, that's perfect. So, mostly for Piper, like, mostly for Pipsqueak, her, <clears throat> her, um, siblings are supposed to be much more taller than her, so, so Pipsqueak, her... Height, she is 12 feet tall. Her younger siblings are are mostly, like, um, up to just 10 feet tall. Her older brother, it, her older brother, like, Pablo, he is mostly, like, four, 14 feet tall. And for Angelo and Angela, their height is mostly 15 feet tall. And for Bagel... And Bella, their height is 16 feet tall. And for Yakuza, Yakuza is still kind of taller than them. I mean, he's just one inch taller than Bagel and Bella. So mostly his height is, <clears throat> is 17 feet tall. So yeah. Next one is going to be Angelo and Angela. So let's start off with Angela. Angelo. Angelo's original name, I mean, original name was supposed to be Blue Bill, but I do not want to name him Blue Bill because I feel like that's a stupid name, so I rechanged it to Angelo. But back then, his earlier, I mean, his earlier design with his sister, he was supposed to be, like, very nice to people. He was supposed to be very polite, and sometimes he could be a little bit filthy and kind of greedy over stuff. I mean, if he wins, he gets greedy. And also him being a little bit of a goofball that he is. But after, since then, I rechanged him into a spoiled rich man. Mostly rich boy. He is known for being rich, and he is known for being born in a royal family who is rich. And he is known for spending his money on drugs, alcohol, and also... And also crystals and gems. And he also spends his money on very cool furniture and also unique pets. But most of the time, what kind of drugs he used. He mostly is known for smoking and also eating very drugged mushrooms. So yeah, and yes, he kind of does look like the one slur. I mean, the one slur's outfit gave me an idea to change Angelo into like the one slur. Sort of, but he is not, but mostly for Angelo, he is not like the Wansler. He does not like to cut off trees for crying out loud, no. He is just known for mostly loving mushrooms a lot. And last but not least, Angela. Angela is supposed to be renamed, her original name was Blue Bell. But I felt like it should not be Blue Bell because it sounded a little bit retarded, in my opinion. My bad. <laughs> Sorry, we changed her name to Angela. So, mostly for Angela, her earlier design, she was supposed to be a little bit like her brother, except she is not that cruel or anything like her brother. I mean, her brother's not that cruel. I mean, like a goofball like her brother, but. Anyways, she was supposed to be, like, obsessed with, um, making friends, but ever since then, I rechanged her, and she's only obsessed with makeup, women, and also she's into girls and men, which she is bisexual, of course, for her twin brother, Angelo, Angelo is bisexual, of course, <laughs> I mean, it's obvious, he's a twink, anyways, so for Angela, she is bisexual and she is and she is mostly dating Gina and the thing is that she was supposed to be shipped with a 
with like a richer man, but I felt like, uh, no. So instead, she won't be shipped with any guy. She's only shipped with Gina. So yeah. And also, she was supposed to be friends with Gina back then in her earlier designs. So we're supposed to be like best friends or so. So yeah. And also, that's pretty much it. And I forgot to say is that um, Angela has like a crystal and gemstone addiction like her brother. She loves gems and crystals a lot and also stones. She likes to collect them in her little collection. And she is also known for liking... And she is also no known for like liking reading magazines, making comics. And also she likes to... <clears throat> she likes to design some stuff. So that's pretty much it for them. So yeah. That's all about their original designs and their full history. That's pretty much it for now. Bye.